Well, hello, everybody, and welcome back to Farthest Frontier. There was somebody who had like a unhappy face that was running down this road, but I guess he's fine now. Um, I kind of started thinking, what is this? Doesn't have any grain. Ooh, that is a problem. Oh, it looks like he just got some. Or someone threw it on the floor out in front of his house. <laughs> I don't know. Um, like when I got done last night recording, I was like, I wonder if I should put time and effort into, um, into rearranging the fields, making the fields look a little better. Like instead of kind of pooking out here, this field could go all the way down and over. Oh, it can't. There's the, uh, the orchards there. I, I guess they're fine. I guess they're fine. I'm just kind of concerned about the food situation here. <sighs> Two months of food is not... It's not ideal. We do need to have more food. We are cranking out the bread, which is kind of our big thing. I, I really do think that not having... um Not having the meat coming in is really hurting us because like the meat was I mean it's it's an extra 300 meat um a year from the cows and so they're at 8 out of 10 they're at 8 out of 10 and he's going to be at 9 out of 10 I think I'm going to slaughter one more cow I just we just need the money uh, money. We just need the meat. Um, and probably up here, I want to put in another wall. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's time for another gatherer's hut. Is there a gatherer's hut here? There is. I wonder if it would it would behoove us to try to find another place that, like, all seasons. I just don't know. I just don't know. Maybe it's time for another farm. Where would another good location for a farm be? I'm so sorry. A crop field. Definitely could stretch a super duper long one right there. And it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Kind of built the city over like the great, <laughs> the really good cropland. Uh... The cows, they, they're, they're, that's theirs. Uh, that's the cows, too. Ooh. Ooh. Really good farmland up there. Mmm. It is a little bit of a walk, though, but it's definitely something to think about. I think I want to do another farm, like, right up against that. Over maximum size. I think I want to do a farm right there. I think. Let's do it. Let's do it. We, I mean, if we do not have food, right? If we do not have food, we do not have a frontier. But I have been kind of ignoring the food situation. That, um, that animal, whatever that is, ran through the guard tower. So that right there is not, is not secure. There's a bear there. If you didn't see it, the bear ran through the, the fence. He like ducked through it, came around. There's his body's right there, you see it. Um Yeah, we just gotta make sure we have food here. I, I I've tried my best to keep the food unspoiled. Like to, to make sure we have like a grain like like the storage, the uh the cellars. But those things are they're almost worthless. 
I feel like those the, the food in there just spoils so fast. Um, I think this is a good play to put this thing right up against, like over here. Ooh, uh, it's okay. We'll put a road there. We'll put a road there. I'll put a road there. Boom. We're gonna put a we're gonna put a food set. Oh, there's already rats here. You be kidding me, bro? Already rats here. Uh, yeah, we'll put the rat catcher there. It's like a little four by four area that, um, we'll put the rack and we'll prioritize it because it's going to eat our friggin' food. <laughs> All right, let's go kind of look over here and see what the distribution is. We have 25 laborers. We have 11, uh, builders, the farmers. We need two more farmers done. Okay. It it says that 23 laborers is still not enough. We need at least 36 people just acting as laborers to make this place work. That's rough. Little house goes in over there. Super nice. We didn't have a rat problem at the beginning of this game. Like, it took a long time for the rats to be an issue. And now they're just kind of like popping up overnight. Look at all the farmers in there just going to town. Hope they don't, they don't ignore their other work to get that done. Beans are halfway done. Is that buckwheat? Yeah, I think it's different. Different type of wheat than uh than the wheat that makes. Oh, we just we just harvested the uh the beans here, so that's done. I tell you what, I want to get rid of that and I want the beans. Oh, no, no, I think I think this field was fine. I think this field was fine. Yeah. Failed to be. Yeah, 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 it's fine. It's fine. There's one crop. Remember the one crop somewhere that was like, uh, it had heat damage. And I, I was like, well, I want to switch those. Like we were, we were, we were, um, ah, oh, geez. I don't remember which one it was. It's just going to have to happen one more year where we have heat damage. And I'm going to have to make a mental note. A brain note. About where that. Uh, which, which field that is. And then make sure that it's uh, it gets fixed. Because I need to switch it. I need to like. Like if let's say it was this one. For instance. And it was this. And this one right here. I don't feel like you'd have a. A problem. With uh with heat because this, this is like a cover crop let's just imagine it was this one and this one got heat damage we could slide it down so it's later in the year or maybe it's good where it's at because it's earlier in the year right um but one of these i definitely know for a fact that one of them somewhere um was messed up because of heat damage it was just too hot during the time that we planted it and we needed to fine tune it to slide it a little bit Probably an apiary out here wouldn't be a bad idea either. If I can find out where the stinking apiary is, that's one of the most difficult things to locate, in my opinion. Is the apiary. Ooh, putting a pub out here too, making sure that like a pub is part of their part of their like setup would be pretty good. Ooh, storehouse and stockyard, maybe. I want 
that, but I don't have glass. Ah, yes, the arborist. That's what it does. The fruit trees. We're going into the winter with 120. Your village is low on, but that's nah, fine. Uh, basket shop, compost yard. It has a monthly cost to it. Yeah. Is that the apiary? Perfect. Okay. It's just like a little, just a little guy. And like, oh, right, right there. Like there's two or three places that we're just not using. You just slap down an apiary and that's just a little bitty baby bit more food that they're getting in. I don't know if honey, if they consider honey a food or not. Why did I build? Why did I do? Oh, for the road. It's going to be a road. The road's going to come <laughs> I should say, why did I just, why did I build it where there's no yada yada? I can put another one there, but there's a lot of overlap. All right. Well, that's good for right now. The rat catcher is up. Is someone employed there? Someone is employed there. We're still making money. We have the road in. Super duper nice. All right. Got the little maypole thing here. They can upgrade, but it didn't really tell me it could upgrade. So I guess it's trying to be sneaky about it. The root seller needs some work and then it'll be done. Very fancy. Kind of am tempted to go ahead and just upgrade it right off the bat. It just needs bricks and money. We'll, we'll upgrade the root cellar. How's the water here doing? 195 is good. The rat catcher took care of the rats. Good job. Rat catcher, also known as a cat. Someone just brought a cat over here and threw the cat in the market and let the cat. Ooh, what's that? Villagers. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh. Yes. There we go. Probably the one on the back side here can go as well. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. How pretty. All right, we have five months of food. Very good, very good. Everybody over here is happy. These these homes haven't hit their next desirability bump, but the school is now in. We have the Maypole, we have the school. A shrine is gonna go in soon, and then whatever that is. Oh, the large park, oh man, that's gonna Oh, and then the shrine, here it comes. And how many people were at 340, 365? I, I believe, uh, I earnestly believe that we'll be able to put all the houses in here that we want. Oh, look at that. They, that, 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 it, that religion just kicked it right over the edge. Um, throw that house in there facing that way. Let's, let's do it this way. So there's a little bit of place right there on the road. We can do something. Maybe we'll, we'll try to spice it up somehow there. Yes, house is here. Can't really fit one in down there. Can't wait. Really so we have a couple, we have a little bit of space here to do something. There. House ain't going that way. House ain't going that way. Yeah, house is there. Yeah. Kind of want to do that and then that. But I'm also, I also realized that that little gate that, that dude just walked through with a wheelbarrow, right? Like the, or maybe it's a girl. I don't want to block that. We'll put this house in here and then we'll just kind of see how it, how, how she goes with, uh, 
whether that's blocked over there or not. Then we'll put a road in there. I think everybody else has a road. Yeah, has access to a road. Cool. And this little area over here ought to get us over the 400 people mark. Because I think that's the last thing we need before we can upgrade our town hall is... Yeah, we need 400 people. We have the trading center upgrade. We have the theater. We have 25 of the large houses. We do need 150 iron, $5,000, and 300 bricks. But that... That stuff we can, uh, oh yeah, yeah, okay, so that root cellar is full. All right, root cellar, we have another place a little bit farther away that we can bring food to now, so. What's this? Construction has been halted due to the winter. Yeah, makes sense. Makes sense. We have 300 planks. I'm not worried about the planks at all. We have 400 logs. Yeah. Oh, this got built too. That's probably what pushed it over the edge and, and made it so like deep purple or uh, deep turquoise to live out here. Push the desirability up. You got somebody working out here? Yeah. Yeah, here he is. He's going to start preaching too. Oh, you have a villager sickened with typhoid. What are you saying over here? You, you're you missing ranged ammunition? Where's my guy? You making arrows, bro? You know what? We're going to get you a helper. We're going to get you a helper to start producing more archery items. How many hides do we have? 81 hides? We can go ahead and start working on more coats. How about some more candles? How about some more soap? The hunters, you I don't think you can you can give the hunters a buddy. Nope, it's always just a one person show. The furniture workshop. A couple more people there. Why not? A hunter house a hunter's house I already got two working there uh, i don't think you need it oh yeah i gave you an extra buddy i think they're working like crazy okay and then over here oh yeah 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 got the potters going Ooh, actually we have so much raw clay probably can do another potter cobbler's workshop is working overtime in the weaver's hut I don't want to give these guys too many people to help because we, we don't we don't have enough of that stuff. And the foresters camp. You guys you guys are doing fine because we have so much of that stuff. This is my barrel maker. I guess let's do another barrel maker. Just to crank out a couple of more barrels. I don't think they're used for anything. Well, I, I shouldn't say that barrels aren't used for anything. Let me let me rephrase that. The thing that they're used for fills up and doesn't degrade, right? Like the root cellar, when it gets all of its barrels, it doesn't degrade barrels. Like it doesn't lose barrels over time. So, in fact, they get stored here. It looks like take a room. All right, four months worth of food. Everybody out here saying they can be upgraded now. How many houses? 370. Oh, look, they all want coats. They're all mad they don't have coats. Go get coats. Make people work at this market. Just one person. Let's put two people out here so far away. I feel like having a second person kind of help run around and manage things is a smart move. Oh, we're going to build over a patch of herbs. I really hope that none of the gatherers... Let me see if I can find a gatherer's hut right quick. Mm, there is a person who is slated for this area. I got to figure out who that is. 
Are you slated for that area? Nope, you're a little bit further south. You are slated for this area. I feel like now might be the time that you can just move on and do some other gathering. Maybe like right here. Yeah, because you'll get some greens. You'll get some of that stuff. You'll get uh, the Hawthorn is actually trash. Like they hate eating it, but they'll get greens. You'll get the herbs there. We're still making money on our taxes. Yes, we are. Everybody's happy. Ooh, the predator attacking. Someone's not happy. Is he running off? Yeah, he's running off into the wilds. Uh, probably wouldn't be a bad idea to put a guard tower up here. Like right here. Let's look at defenses right quick. Right there on the, uh, that really wouldn't protect. I guess we can just kind of, yeah, put a tower there. Why not? Why not? I like the little area here. Yeah, they, as soon as their house upgrades, they become unhappy for some reason. I guess because there's something that they're, they, sh they want, but it's not readily available. Um, some weapons. Yeah, I'll sell you some weapons. Um, iron I'm going to hold on to. My heavy tools. A new villager immigrated. Uh, three new villagers are born. Is a settler. Oh, yeah, yeah. Crops ready first. I want to pause it right quick. A lot of things are happening here. Um, yeah, I, I'll sell two. I'll sell two of those. Uh, we don't have any plate mail or heavy weapons yet, but we will get those. Uh, he's got regular tools, which I think I'll buy. Uh, we don't like glassware, man. I really want glassware, but we would, we would, we would burn through that glassware so fast. It's almost pointless to buy it. There's sand. There's sand to make our own glassware. But he's charging a arm and a leg for it. All right. I'm good with him for right now. The weed level here is skyrocketing and the rockiness is high, but it's almost perfect for. All right, let's just do some work, work, work all this year. Next year, we'll do a cover crop and then we'll throw. This is something we want to do wheat necessarily. I guess so, because we, we use wheat for beer and everything and we should build a pub out here. And then we'll do another cover crop and maybe some like lettuce. Does lettuce take away fertility? Yeah, it takes away fertility by a lot. Uh, well, we, we do have a cover crop that kind of helps that. What about weeds? Weed suppression is 3 out of 10. No weed suppression there for that one. Weed suppression is 6 out of 10. Buckwheat. Weed suppression. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, buy. And let's do... Let's do some buckwheat, bro. All right. And then this field has, yep. Yeah, let's go over here and make sure that we have his capped out on the farmers. There we are. All right. Three new villagers born, children have grown up. Very good. Oh, uh, 383. And then those, those last houses are gonna do it. Oh, villagers die probably of old age, yeah. Yeah, so I think I think we're done. I think we have the four hundred for the last uh the last upgrade. Look at all the farmers. Just a just just a whole battalion of farmers just rushing the field.
So good. So good. All right. Let's go over here and wheel and deal with this guy. We'll sell you a couple of swords. And we're going to sell you two of our heavy machine tools. Okay. And then what else did I say? I, I guess I wanted tools from him. Buying tools always makes people happy. Buying transfer. There's 14 tools there. I see another trader coming, I think. Uh, no. No, I think it was that girl. I thought another trader was coming, so I wanted to hold on to my money for a little big, big bit. Oh, like right here. Okay, so this one. Planting wheat as soon as the season rolls in is no bueno because it, it, it we lose some due to the cold. So we need to move that cover crop first and then plant the wheat later in the, the year. So that's something I need to remember. Cover crop, then wheat. Cover crop, then wheat. When this, this year gets over. I need to switch that. Oh, poo, poo, poop. Okay. So bring in the rate. Bring in folks. Where's my stinking towers at here? Add a person. Add a person. Add a person. Add a person. All right, we're all okay. Good, good, good. And then the military. Uh, what is this here? Flag a combat area. Can you tell me where we're being? Oh, okay, so they're the, they're on a road, and I can I can physically see them. And that's good, but we don't have a guard tower up this way, unfortunately. Okay, get here and get the military. Flag a combat area. Not 100% sure where my... Maybe maybe the, the, the military. Hold on here. Let's move the flag to that. And I rang the bell. So all these folks should just get inside. My gosh, so many of them. Oh, they're 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 juking us here. Juking us here. They're going off to the right here. Oh oh, the people who are inside there are now shooting at animals. <laughs> it's the deer. The deer are helping them. They seem to say. Yeah, they're going to break through that freaking wall like no one's business, bro. All right, new trader has arrived. Let's go ahead and look at what the new trader wants here. Want some of our clothes? We can help with that. Uh, yeah, sell some tin clothes. I uh, don't want to sell my shoes. Don't want to sell my soap. Uh, I would sell my planks, but she's not asking a very fair price for them. She's got some smoked meat. She's got some tools. We love tools. We might buy some tools. We don't need any weapons, even though we're being raided. Uh, she's got halberts, and she's not asking a lot for them. So we might, well, we have two in storage already. We might pick up two more. Crude weapons and then the hammer. Okay. So we know what she's about. We know what we're doing there. Uh, where is the military, I wonder? Where did I station them before? Like, ooh. A deceased villager. Uh, hopefully that was a person who died of old age. I, I kind of would like to know where the military is at. If you click on this. If you click on this. Does it show you? Oh, okay. The military is very close to being where it ought to be. Good, good, good. All right. I know there's like 300 million people over there. And they probably don't feel like it's fair that they have to fight so many people. But this is their job. All right. They've broken in the gate over here. That's the thing. Um, maybe I want to move them like over here to this. Okay, they're in, and there's the military. Military should now start fighting them. All right. Not quite sure what the military. Okay, they're, yeah, they're getting there. They're fighting. That's fighting. Back in the town hall. All right, military's in there doing its thing. Military's killed some people. They're using their crossbows a lot right now. Okay. Murdering people by the bushel. Yeah, yeah. These guys here, they're retreating, and I think it's because they are they have very low health. I don't think it's because they picked up something. And they're running because they, they got their 
their fat loot. Some of the military is out in the woods. Not 100% sure what they're. Their strat here is. Okay. Well, I might just get back to their their jobs there. Thank you and rebuild that please and thank you because we're still being raided a raid party of 68 raiders is attacking one raider is damaging a building and 49 raiders have been killed one raider is damaging a building would you would you let me know where the one raider is that's damaging the building is that Click on the flag here, return to the barracks. I don't know where the last guy is. Uh, ooh. Actually got... I got messed up a little bit there. Alright. Probably during that time. Yep, our 10 clothes have shown up. So we're going to sell those. Alright, cool, cool, cool. I think we just want to hold on to the money there. I think we're just gonna hold on to the money there. Maybe we have 104 uh, stone. Let's let's go around and start doing our beautification project here and start turning all these older dirt roads into cobblestone roads in the old city. You know, nothing against the the new city that we built, but you know, the old city probably. They're probably waiting for this upgrade for a while. We have a new traveling merchant guy. Is that, did you say that? We're so popular. The village, the village was raided. Raid size was 68. We killed 49. No kill, villagers died. Two buildings were destroyed, but no items were pillaged. I can live with that. Okie dokie. He would like some of our world famous baskets. Some of our boots. He wants... Uh, stone, but that's not going to happen. And if we had any sand, he'd like some of it. He is selling planks, but he is asking for a reasonable price. He's also selling clay, which we have a boohoo to love. He's asking for pottery, which we have a boohoo to love. Uh, we have a little bit of flour laying around. Oh, he's not asking a lot for flour. We might buy some of this flour. I think I'll make a little impulse buy right here. $200 worth of flour. Buy and transfer that, please. Uh... He just got straight up beans, which we have a thousand beans we're good on. Healing root we have a lot of. Oh, and he's selling wheat for a dollar. Trees grow 50% faster and orchids produce 25% more fruit. Ooh, yeah, that's really nice. All right. Well, thank you, sir. I, think we, I don't think we really want to sell you anything, but... That was really good. Twenty villagers graduated. That's so nice. The rat catcher there and there. So I think these rat problems are going to go away. And because we have so many builders, those roads actually should get upgraded. Remember that time we told the roads to get upgraded and it took forever. It took like five years for those things to get upgraded. It was really quite sad, the amount of time it took. Kind of feel like I want to shoot the gap there with a road. You know what I mean? Oh, ooh. Look at that, bro. And maybe bring it in over here to this. Oh, right there, parallel to the orchard. I love that. Cool little intersection here. There's a lot of different ways you can go for places. 
would even be cooler if I could like run that fence that way too. I don't think I can. I think that fence is uh Maybe I maybe I maybe I can. I mean let's uh, really how cool I like that. This side, the orchard, we're just like, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're not gonna, we're not gonna, we're not gonna hedge in the orchard on that side. But this side, oh boy. I also feel like that could, what, 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 what? Predator attacking? Oh God, it is. It's like a real predator. It's a bear. Run, run for your life. Okay, bear can't come inside. Now he's just gonna sit there like an idiot. Oh, actually this guy. Bear was smart. That bear like suckered that guy into coming outside. If he did just, well, they got him. <laughs> That's amazing. A villager has died from old age. Nothing to do with the bear. Nothing to do with the bear. Um, I feel like here though we probably could have. Yeah. Well, what tree is that? Is that a? That's a pear tree. Okay, so we, we, what we can do is we can just plant some more trees, part of the orchard, like up here. But I feel like we could have went back one more. We definitely could have. Well, maybe not. Okay, good. It's 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 perfect. It's perfect. It's perfect. We just need a couple of more trees there to make. Oh, like that that pear tree. It, it doesn't even get harvested. Um. So we, we could bring that, that fence around this way and give ourselves a little something right there. But definitely we could plant more. Uh, we have 11, we have 20, we only have two. <gasps> we have two? Oh, they're four by four. No. That thing. Well, that's why we only, we only have two pear trees there. Or gigantic we could rip up the wow well, we probably couldn't rip up the fence it probably was too whatever does that thing ever upgrade no wow one would think that the orchard would upgrade neat that, that 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 right there um it's neat that that grew i guess no one who produced last 12 months 33 grand total 193 is anybody Planted near an arborist building are maintained and harvested by the arborist. Okay, so it's not it's not being it's not being harvested right now. It grew, but it's just that's it. Hey, four hundred and ten people. We now have enough houses to get the maximum number of, or to get the last upgrade. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um, now that that has been harvested, can I, because the fertility is high, right? The fertility is high. Well, let, let's let them plant the crop. I just got to remember. I just got to remember that problem. Yep. And you need grain. Grain is coming. We just harvested a poop. Well, not a poop poop ton of it, but we just harvested some of it. There they go. They're working that field. Getting all the rocks out of it. Hold on one second, folks. Oh, we're almost at time here. Give me one more second, though, and we'll... Uh, we're, we're almost at time. All right, we're back here. I kind of feel like instead of just randomly being here... Maybe I should move him over here somewhere. And then that way, somebody who lives in this area will have like kind of a pretty decent walk to their job. Well, it's, it's fine. It's fine. I really don't remember why I threw the brick maker out here in the middle of nowhere. Oh, because it's closer to the coal. We manufacture coal here. Yes. And I think there was a place for, yeah, there was a place for clay right there and I guess my idea was like well the clay's right there the coal's right there bingo bango bongo done 
another another place for coal right there. Uh, coal and clay right there actually, or clay. The only the only weird thing about this game is like I really I really would like to what is that? Shoal the fish? Are there? Oh, there's gonna be another little lake down here. That's what I was about to say. Is it the only thing I I kind of would like more about this game is if if the if the um if the exploration were a little bit more like if it was handled a little better instead of just grabbing a random person or is there a oh there is an exp yeah okay so how do you do this confirm placement it oh you have to do it on the map yeah that makes sense that makes sense. You got to do it in a known area. All right. Well, so we're exploring then. We're going to explore kind of around where that place is being built. All right. There we go. We'll, we'll have somebody explore that. <laughs> am I, am I on the very threshold is i guess it's the iron uh yeah it's probably the iron because yeah, i have the money <laughs> that's funny let's go look at um our iron production which i think is over here how are you guys doing the iron mine wouldn't mind seeing some more iron be brought in wouldn't mind that at all And then up here, no upgrade because we don't have the level four town hall. And then the foundry. Produced 110 last year. It would be nice if they sh if they said how much it consumed. So this one is producing like 110, and that's great. Tell me how much is being pr uh, consumed here. And that will help me figure out if I'm over or under producing the iron ingots. Yeah, so I don't mind. I, I up the number of people who's harvesting iron ore. I'm gonna up the number of people who actually are producing the iron ingots too. I wanna I wanna have some of those laying around. The building has room for one more worker. I guess the individual there died of old age or something all right what is the upgrade cost on these stinking wells it's not it's not negligible it's 25 stone which is quite a lot I do i do get tired of seeing the wells telling me they want to upgrade My cute little area out here. Oh, look at that new road. And they're using it. That's the, that's the best part. The best part. Look at them. Look at them using that new road. Look how good the little... I mean, it would be nice if it was diagonal, but that's fine. And then was that... Does that dead end in the... Well, it doesn't, doesn't matter. That looks so cool, though. Love it. What is this? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Out here exploring. That was some good exploring. Oh, look at that gigantic body of water, dude. That's that's amazing. We definitely need to put some fisher people out there. Definitely need to put some fisher people out there. I mean, I mean, it even says there's a shoal of fish, you know. Fishing shack. Invalid placement. Fish area of eight. Fish count seven hundred and fifty. Fishing productivity is one hundred and fifty percent. And we'll build a road. The 
directly from that guy and we'll we'll like run it up here a little bit and then we'll br we'll bring it right into that boom huge 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 believer in the crossroad theory you know what i mean bro huge believer in the crossroad theory bro six months of food very good someone is sick i'm, I'm sure they're getting tended to that cover crop is coming to an end. Let's look at the barns here. Nine. Nine. Cowies. Ten out of ten cowies. So good. And ten out of ten cowies. So good. Next year we will have two barns producing meat again. And we'll have that barn being spun up. That's so good. That's so good. That is the best thing I've heard today. We're gonna do we're gonna do one or two years of all those being at ten, and then we're gonna build two barns out here, and we're gonna we're gonna throw some some cowies out here. We'll put the barns right here and have the cowies eating out here in this area, just north of this. Yada yada. I kind of already want to build the barns. You know what I mean? Like I kind of just want to go ahead and do it. Let me look and see what the uh, is it fertility. Is the fertility, is that what the barns run off of too? I wonder. I wonder if it's for fertility for barns. Arborist. Bakery. It is under food production, is it not? Is it a resource? Sometimes I feel like they throw, they throw things under resources. You know what? I bet it is under food production, but I guess it's the level one food production. Forger shack, fishing hut. Smoke. Yeah. Oh no, it's not. Oh, there it is. Barn. It looks so different. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at look at look at the delicious grass there is out here for the barn. We could actually put it right outside the walls. Because this is hilly, and you can't really build on it. So it kind of makes sense that the cowies would get it, you know? You know what I'm saying? We just put it right there, like right there. Little Zuckerman's, Zuckerman's barn, you know what I mean? Right there on the side of the road. And then, and then right behind it is where the movies eat. I'm doing it. I'm gonna go ahead and build it. I'm gonna go ahead and build it. I'll put the grazing area right there behind it. Just give me build build up this area a little bit more. Give these people a place to go work. Yes, sir. Maybe maybe one more hard year in store with the food situation. Uh, low on laborers. Fifteen. Yeah. Negative one. Oh, is someone sick? Yeah, someone's sick. We probably need to put a healer's hut out there in the new area. That probably needs to be a thing that's done. I mean, I guess they could walk over there, right? Is this $25 for a healer's house? Where's my pub at? They need a pub. And we never built an apothecary shop. I don't know the difference between an apothecary... Did we build one of these? Oh, apothecary shops built zero. It tells you. It tells you. We don't have the glass. We never built it because we don't have the glass. The pub. We gotta put the pub in somewhere. Um I feel like if we put the pub in like a central location, like right here on this road, like I feel like that'd be the best. I feel like everybody gets hit. The pub pub gets its its drinkers. So we'll put the pub right there. Bring that road all the way down here to there, and just bring it down like there. Did you did you click in? I hope I hope that like it clicks in and, and like makes that look good. And we'll do another road. Goes on right there. Like that. Very lovely. 
very lovely. So pleased with this game. It's one of the best games. Um, there are no stones in the work area. Cool. Um, this is one of the best games that I have picked up in a long time. Uh, I think there's tons of stone out there. But I think what I would like to do is I think I'd like to move this building. This is probably like right here. That road just it doesn't do the it doesn't do it justice. I'm, I'm going to move it over here because the stones we're going to look for are going to be over here more so than they are um, over there. And then is there a there's like a place to, there's like a I don't even know. I think we're I think we're okay to say goodbye to that building. No one lives there. Everyone just walks home from their their job. So I think it's okay. I will say that I think this this building here is the only building that produces stone in the entire in the entire uh, yada yada. So I think we probably number one need to upgrade it. Uh, maybe not even upgrade it, but we need to assign more workers to it because we do need more stone. I would like to see all of our streets upgraded. Okay, is it the end of the season? Can I switch that? I'm going to say no to that. I'm going to slide the cover crop first. Then I'm going to put that down so it doesn't lose any to frost. Uh, are you in right? You are. Perfect. Market. That market there. That's a rough market. That's a rough market. Because it really doesn't cover hardly any I mean one two three four five six seven eight buildings that's just not that that's not that efficient I probably should have moved one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen yeah hmm I probably should have moved that market and moved those houses out here instead of built new houses. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. If it if it if it boils down to it, we might have a humongous like Tennessee Valley Authority project where we we flatten this area over and over and over and over and over, and we just keep flattening it until it's until it's. Uh, until it's something we can use. Like just over and over and over. We just flatten it. Over and over and over. Boom, 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 boom. We get some more houses on the outside. Like tear down the wall. Put the wall on the side of the hill. Put more houses there. Just make this. Make that whole area there worth it. And that's all we really need to do. We can move the barracks down a little bit. We can put some houses right there. We can make this a little bit more efficient. The builders will hate it, but the builders, you know, their life is already rough as it is. Ah, uh, the barn's going in. So good. Probably need to put a stockpile out here. Now, that the more I think about it, because the only stockpile we have is in the very middle of town. And if they can store some things out here, like building materials and stuff, like it might be super duper nice. So what is this? A place for villagers to talk about building materials such as logs, stone, and wood planks. Large storage structure used to store all items. Does that nestle? Oh my gosh, look how perfect. Look how absolutely perfect. That just boom right there. And it, it costs 10 logs. And a little bit of work. And then we can put a storehouse here. And probably the, now that's like kind of a liability. Uh, because probably if it gets raided, they can come here and raid some crap. So we might have to keep an eye on that. But we'll just see how she goes. All right. Man, we are, I think we are overworking our builder. Uh, one, two, three, four, 
five, six, eh, six, six projects, and then a bunch of roads, but it shouldn't be the end of the world for them. Did they get the uh, cobblestone road? Oh, they did get the cobblestone road laid. Look at that. That is so pretty. 20. It is so pretty. I mean, not right now during the winter because the winter makes everything look like butt, but that's really pretty. I like Alex seeing all the cobblestone. Is it time? It's time. All right. Thank you so much, folks, for watching. Have a great day, and we will see you next time when our little expansion over here really just, it's just going to take off. It's going to take off. We're going to have the cowies over here. It's going to be great. You're absolutely going to love it. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And if you have a moment, please like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye-bye.